Hello students welcome back to my channel in this video I am going to discuss in detail about the Nernst equation. Nernst equation gives the relationship between the electrode potential and concentration of the electrolytic solution. So what is the importance of Nernst equation? It gives the relationship between electrode potential and concentration of electrolytic solution it can be represented as E equal to E naught plus 0 0.059 by N into log concentration of metal ions. So, Nernst equation is E equal to E naught plus 0 0.059 by N into log concentration of metal ions where N represents the number of electrons transferred where n is the number of electrons transferred e is electrode potential And E naught is the standard electrode potential. Let us derive Nernst equation in a simple manner. For that purpose, let us consider a reversible redox reaction. That is m plus n gains n number of electrons and results in the formation of the metal according to van hoff's equation For a reversible reaction, free energy change is related to equilibrium constant. So, there is a relation between free energy change and equilibrium constant. So, according to Van Hoff's equation for a reversible reaction, free energy and equilibrium constant are related as delta G is equal to delta G naught plus RT ln concentration of products divided by concentration of reactants where delta G is free energy change delta G naught is standard free energy change R is gas constant T is temperature at absolute scale that is 298 degrees Kelvin or 25 degrees centigrade. For a reversible reaction, the free energy change and 
electrode potential or related as minus delta G is equal to N F E and minus delta G naught equal to N F E naught where E is the electrode potential and E naught is the standard electrode potential. Let us substitute the values of delta G and delta G naught in the above equation then it becomes minus n f e equal to minus n f e naught plus r t l n concentration of metal divided by concentration of metal ions let us divide the above equation with minus n f then the above equation becomes e equal to e naught minus r t by n f into ln concentration of metal divided by concentration of metal ions in case of pure metals the concentration of metal is equal to 1 then the above equation can be written as e equal to e naught minus rt by n f ln 1 by concentration of metal ions it can also be written as E equal to E naught plus R T by N F into L N concentration of metal ions. The above equation can be written as E equal to E naught plus R T by N F into 2.303 log concentration of metal ions where R is gas constant and the value of R is equal to 8.314 joule per kelvin mole T is absolute temperature and it is 298 degrees kelvin or 25 degrees centigrade and the value of F is equal to 96,500 coulombs. On substituting the values of R, T, F in the above equation, the above equation becomes E equal to E naught plus 0 0.059 by N into log concentration of metal ions and it is called as Nernest equation and here n is the number of electrons transferred. This Nernest equation is highly useful for the calculation of electrode potential. So coming to the significance of Nernest equation. This Nernest equation is highly useful for the calculation of electrode potential. In turn, the electrode potential depends upon three factors, namely concentration of ions, temperature and the nature of electrode. So, the electrode potential depends upon 
concentration of the ions temperature and nature of the electrode if you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day